All right, how's everybody doing today? Good. Good. All right, so we're going to be starting our final project in this class, and it is to do a self-portrait. So I'm going to show you an example of what a completed self-portrait looks like. All right. So I would like you to get into groups and think together about what steps you need to do to complete this art project. OK? What are we doing again? Uh, what you should do is think about what steps were necessary to complete this art project. From the beginning? Yeah, from the beginning. So they just paint to the face. And then what we're going to do from the beginning? Or. Um, so, what steps exactly are we supposed to explain? I don't get it. All right, so what did the artist do first? Did he draw like thumbnails first? Did he do a sketch of his face first? Did he do it in black and white with pencil? Like, what did he do first? So, we're supposed to guess, or is there a right answer? Uh, everybody's going to have a different answer. That's why we're doing group work. Okay. Uh, do you get it? Can you do this? Yeah, sure. We can do it. Yeah, okay. okay. All right. Okay. Uh, how about five minutes? Okay. Okay. So how are we supposed to know? <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. How's everybody doing today? Good. Good. Mm -hmm. Good. All right, so we're ready to start our final project. Our final project will be to do a self-portrait. So let me show you an example of a self-portrait. All right, so rather than me telling you how to do this self-portrait step by step, I want you to figure out what did the artist do step by step to complete a self-portrait. Now, everybody's going to have a different opinion, so that's why I would like to do it in group work. In group work, you're going to get together, pool your thoughts, and think about what steps does the artist tend to do first, second, and third, and fourth to be able to create something like this. All right, so we're going to do this, uh, and I'm going to help you out in two ways. The first way is I'm going to give you some examples of what I'm looking for, for possible steps that the artist can do. And then the second, I want to go over group work roles. So group work can get a little bit messy since it takes about 20, 25 minutes. So we're just going to review these four jobs that uh, you are going to have in group work. Okay, so first, 
uh, what are the steps that the artist took to complete this portrait? Well, one example is maybe he drew thumbnail sketches. Thumbnail sketches are these small little drawings that are usually drawn just with a pencil or some charcoal just to be able to figure out the composition. Maybe he did that first. Maybe he did something else. So that's an example of a step that you could think about for your group work. All right, so the next thing is I want you to think about the jobs and responsibilities for group work. So does anybody remember how many jobs there are during group work? Four? There's four. All right, so name one of the jobs. There's the writer. The writer, and what is the responsibility of the writer? Um, to take all the notes. Good, all right. So what's another job or responsibility during group work? The coordinator. The coordinator, and what's his responsibility, his or hers? To make sure everyone stays on track. Right, exactly, to stay on track, to keep an eye on the time to make sure that we finish up in time. What's another job? Checker. Checker, and what does the checker do? Um, check grandma and spelling mistakes. Right, so you're going to be working with the writer to be able to make sure all, those, uh, all of that grammar on the notes is somewhat good. All right, and then there's another job. Do you remember what the job is? The speaker. <laughs> the speaker, and what's the responsibility of the speaker? Um, to share all of our findings in our group work with you and the rest of the class. Exactly, so after group work, I'm going to ask, so what's your opinion? What do you think we should do first, second, and third to complete this art project? And so I'm going to look towards you for some of those answers. All right, so how long do you think you need to be able to complete this uh, group work? Do you need five minutes, an hour? Mm, I think 30 minutes would be good. 30 minutes? What do you think? 10 minutes. 10 minutes? I'm thinking let's have a happy medium. How about 20 minutes? Does that sound good? Perfect. All right. All right, get to work.